Hello everyone, this video is about the types of reactions seen in leprosy. The reactions which are called lepra reactions can be classified into two types, type 1 lepra reaction and type 2 lepra reaction. Type 2 lepra reaction is also known as erythema nodosum leprosum. Now let us try to understand both of them on the basis of a few characteristics. The first one is timing of both of the reactions. Type 1 lepra reaction is seen within a period of 3 years of treatment. Whereas type 2 reactions can be seen any time before, during or after treatment. The main type of immunity involved in type 1 reactions is type 4 type of hypersensitivity which is a delayed type of hypersensitivity which is cell mediated. Whereas in type 2 lepra reactions, we see type 3 hypersensitivity which is mediated by immune complexes. This is carried out by humoral immunity. Type 1 lepra reactions are seen more commonly in the borderline forms which is the BL, BB and BT forms. Whereas type 2 lepra reactions are seen in lepromatous leprosy, the LL form. In type 1 lepra reactions, there will be an inflammation of the pre-existing lesions which means that the lesions that are already present in the body of the person undergo further changes and inflammation. Along with that, patients with type 1 lepra reaction also present with nerve abscesses. Patients with a type 2 lepra reaction will present with new lesions which arise newly and along with that, there will be systemic manifestations present. For type 1 lepra reactions, the treatment given is steroids. Steroids are the drug of choice, especially prednisolone, which is given at a dosage of 1 mg per kg. This is tapered for a period of 12 weeks. In type 2 lepra reactions, if the patient presents with the lesions for the first time, the drug of choice is steroids, which is again prednisolone at a dose of 1 mg per kg. However, if the patient presents repeatedly, along with steroids, clofazamine or thalidomide is added. The nerve abscesses in type 1 lepra reactions are treated by incision and drainage of the abscess. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.